Hey everyone, today we're demonstrating how to upgrade both the SSD and memory in GS76 Studio. These could also apply to WS76 and Creator 17. Let's start by preparing the following tools to make the process easier and safer during the upgrade. A plastic printing tool, a paper clip, a Philips number no. 1 head screwdriver, and an anti-static wrist strap or gloves. For the SSD and memory, you will need to get the correct specification to get the best compatibility experience. GS76 still provides two DDR4 3200 slots and supporting up to 64GB of memory. As for the SSD, GS76 still also provides two slots of SSD, one for NVMe PCIe Gen 3 and another for NVMe PCIe Gen 4. Before you begin pulling everything apart, Please make sure that your GS76 Studio is turned off and the adapter connector to the laptop is removed. Flip it on its back and insert the paper clips into the battery reside pin hole and hold it for 4 seconds. The battery power will be successfully cut off. The laptop will not turn on unless you connect the adapter back. Remember to take note on all of the screws and which hole it is removed from as they are slightly different. We suggest you to grab a piece of paper and put it next to the laptop. When you remove each screw, just place it on the corresponding spot where you remove it on the paper. That way, you can keep track on where it goes. Using the screwdriver, unscrew the back cover of the laptop. The laptop contains the total of 15 screws. After removing all the screws, use the plastic print tool to lift the bottom door from the upper side to detach the hook. Then gently scratch through the case from the left and right side. Remove four screws on battery. Disconnect battery cable, then remove the battery. If you want to add an additional SSD, here it is how you do it. Remove the screw. Plug in the additional SSD, then screw the hole at the end of the SSD, so it is held firmly on its spot. Assemble the GS76 steel and check the status in BIOS. If you want to upgrade the RAM on the other side of the motherboard, you still need to continue and finish the following steps. Disconnect the speaker cable. Disconnect keyboard cable. Disconnect the touchpad cable. Disconnect keyboard LED cable. Disconnect keyboard LED cable. Disconnect fingerprint cable. Disconnect EDP cable. Disconnect camera cable. Disconnect the Wi-Fi card antenna, then use the screwdriver to remove the screw attaching the Wi-Fi chips to the motherboard. Disconnect sleep cable. Remove the miler. Remove the screw and the DC in module. Remove two screws on motherboard and lift out the motherboard.
Finally, now that the motherboard is removed, you will be able to see the two RAM slots. To upgrade the memory, set up the memory absorbers. Press the slot hook with both hands and then remove the memory. Insert the new memory into the memory slot with mirror angle. Just reverse the process on how you dismantle it to assemble it back. Make sure that all the screws and cables return to their original position. Let's boot up the system to ensure that the upgrades were successful. Connect the laptop to AC power, press the power button, and repeatedly hit the delete key to enter BIOS. Select storage information to view information of the newly installed SSD. Hit the escape key to return to the main page. Now select system information to view information on the newly installed memory. And that's how you install the extra RAM and storage on the MSI GS76, Creator 17 and WS76. There are quite some process to go through, but hopefully you nail it.